Today is the ninth day of Vlogmas. Hello everyone and welcome to Monday. Today is the ninth day of Vlogmas, December 9th, 2019. I'm coming to you at the end of the day to let you know the highlights of today. Basically, it was just a regular catch-up day. Not much happened as in progress. We're trying to catch up desperately on different assignments that we haven't been able to complete because we've been doing a lot of iReady testing. Now, mostly done. I have two more students that were absent the last two days of last week, so they need to catch up with their math assessment for iReady, but hopefully by tomorrow they'll be done, and then we can start moving along with the other things that we have to do in class. I did manage to wrap up a brand new book this morning and I placed it by our Christmas tree and our menorah. And then when it was time, I randomly selected a student who unwrapped it and then we showed it to the class and then I proceeded to read it. I'll give you a close look on the book. It is the story of the Maccabees, which is the story of Hanukkah. And it was a great story because it uses rhyme and it was showing how it takes a few people to know the right thing to do and go ahead and do that. So we did that and then it was just time to go to lunch. After lunch, the students took their spelling pretest for this week and then we were working on our doodle notes for chapter three in our social studies book. Today was the last day for the students to finish, whether they completely got it colored or not. Today was the last day because we've been working on that for a few days, so tomorrow they'll take the test for that chapter. After that, it was time for the students to go to PE and then we went ahead and did some math lessons at the end of the day and the students started taking their mid-chapter checkpoint. So let me show you my completed doodle notes so you can see the completed version all fully colored. Here are the doodle notes showing each section in the chapter and this goes clockwise. So it starts with the section on elevation, then it goes to rivers and oceans, or ocean because we only have one ocean by us and then we go to the fall line natural resources a long growing season and dangerous weather so those are my completed doodle notes for chapter three that i also modeled to the students to kind of give them an idea of what to do the first time they're doing doodle notes in my classroom and this was our holiday read aloud for today it is a story by Tilda Balsley, and I think I want to show you right here. Sometimes it only takes a few who know what's right and do it too. So that is the repetition part of the rhyme of the story. And it was a really nice, beautiful story to share with the students. And they really, really enjoyed it. All right, so that is basically what we ended up doing in class today. I'm not gonna end the vlog just yet. I am going to take my son to an appointment and then I have an appointment myself. But after the appointment, I may be going to somewhere. So we'll see where we end up going. All right, so I'll see you later. Hello again, everyone. So I wanted to give you a quick update. I just finished my appointment with my doctor. And what I'm going to do right now is I'm actually going to go to Barnes & Noble and have a little walk around, be surrounded by books. That's my second happy place other than the ocean and the beach. And I haven't gone there in a while, so I think it's a really good night to do that. So let's go.
So this is definitely my favorite place to be, walking around with coffee, Starbucks coffee, and looking at the beautiful stationery. I love the stationery section and the little gift sections that you can get for people. Also the kids' books section as well. So just walking around and trying to finish off the little bit of time that I want to give myself here before making my final purchases and I'll show you what it is that I'm getting. So here are the things that I am taking with me. I love the Stedler fine liners and this one happens to be Unicorn Dreams and I love these colors so I am definitely taking this one with me. Luna Lovegood is my favorite Harry Potter character and I love this quote, things we lose have a way of coming back to us in the end if not always in the way we expect and I just have to take this with me because it's so cool and she's a fellow Ravenclaw just like me. So definitely taking this bookmark. I love these quotable magnets, so I'm taking this one and this one. I already showed you this little book of affirmations, so I'm taking this one with me. So many great sayings in here. So, yep. This is awesome, modern calligraphy and lettering, and this is only 10 bucks, so way to go. And I love Joanna Basford, and this is how to draw the Inky Wonderlands. So she kind of guides you how to draw all these cute little doodles. And this is right up my alley. So these are the things that I'll be taking with me today and treating myself to all these amazing little things. Okay, I have a confession to make. As I'm walking out, I forgot that I wanted to bring this picture book to my classroom. And it's a choose your own adventure kind of thing. You choose your path in the story. So it looks really interesting. And they're selling it for $7.99 instead of $17.99 if you buy another children's book. So I'm gonna go ahead and buy this one, which is a New York Times bestseller, Snowman at Night and these could be added to our read alouds. So yeah, let me go back to the cash register and purchase these two books. All right, I am now definitely done. I also forgot to mention on my way to the checkout the first time, I found this magazine on mindfulness and I said I have to get it. It's called the Mindfulness Journal, The Ultimate Guide to Wellbeing. It looks so interesting, so I grabbed a copy. And that is my trip to Barnes & Noble and my ninth day of Vlogmas. I hope you enjoyed coming along with me. If you did, don't forget to hit the like button, leave a comment down below, let me know what you thought or any questions you may have. Also, if you haven't subscribed, please consider subscribing and hitting that bell for notifications so you don't miss any future videos. I hope you have a beautiful, magical day and don't forget to smile. Hello dreamers, wishers, and magical thinkers. Thank you so much for making it to the very end of this video and for showing your support. If you'd like to subscribe, you can do so by clicking on my picture down here. You can also check out my latest videos here and here. Don't forget to believe in the magic that's inside you because you are capable of great things. See you next time.